I became interested in Dr. Bernardo and in mm. the story of Dr. Bernardo and the orphanages, and I thought that I would really like to write a story about the first child mm. who made Bernardo aware of the plight of destitute children in London in his time. I think children are always the, the very conscious and aware of children who are less fortunate than themselves. Mm -hmm. And although Street Child takes place in the middle of the 1800s, mm -hmm. um, there are street children today. Every child in, in Britain will be aware of the fact mm -hmm. that throughout the world there are street children mm -hmm. living in the same sort of way, destitute. And I think the very fact that this was a real little boy, although most of the story is made up because nothing really is known about Jim Jarvis, mm -hmm. I think the fact that it's a real child makes them think, well, it, it could be me. Mm. This could have happened to me. I think there's a lot of, of activities um, and outside interest that can develop from reading the book. For instance, of course, it's set in Victorian times. Um, very very well documented period in our lives but suddenly when you're aware that uh, you know these these are real children this really happened um, it's so helpful for for a teacher to be able to make that connection yeah. with children children have heard of bernardo's for instance it's a contemporary way of looking at, at historical yeah. fact loads of letters <laughs> from children uh, about Street Child and they seem to get a lot from it. They seem to empathise a lot with Jim mm. and his situation but they also seem to be um, interested in the language that I mm. use, um, the kind of way that I write, the imagery that I like to use and I think uh, maybe that's a, another dimension that teachers can explore mm. with children when they're reading the book. An enthusiastic teacher will encourage children to read. If a teacher reads herself or himself and loves the books, yeah. that love is, is definitely going to pass, be passed on to the children. And encouraging children to talk about books that they love, finding ways to, um, to express openly how a book has affected them um, and wanting to share mm. their feelings about a book with other children. All these things are really, really helpful. Yeah. I think it goes without saying, mm. doesn't it, that um, a, a, a real book, a book that is well written, well crafted, um, has good strong characters, has an interesting subject, mm -hmm. is going to it's, it's going to be a joy for children to read and then hopefully they'll want to read more mm. by that author or of that kind of book. And, and if reading's a pleasure, then they're going to want to read more. Mm. Yeah.